Hi, Sue Fletcher here. And I really want to talk about um, the sun, different sun signs and the different parts of the body that um, each sun sign can have a problem with. So let's start with Aries because that's the first sign. Um, Aries people do suffer with their heads. So headaches, um, neuralgia, and I, my husband is an Aries and um, he only has to go out um, and there's a bit of rain in the in the wind or a bit of wind and without a hat and he's got neuralgia and he does suffer with headaches so i think it's really important that um aries people do look after their heads and always have a hat handy or you know a scarf um ready because um they are the ones that are going to suffer with with their heads so um Obviously, um, Taurus is the next sign, and I'm a Taurian, and we suffer with our throats. And actually, I have my tonsils out at five. Um, and uh, so, um, you know, you have to be careful again. You know, you need a scarf around there, really. Make sure that, it's particularly in the winter, that your throat is really um, protected. And um, with the next sign is Gemini. So Gemini um, rules the lungs and um, the circulation and um, you often f find um, cyclists um, are Gemini and obviously they need a lot of lung capacity to be cycling all the time it's quite interesting and um, it rules the nerves and uh, and the arms and the shoulders and uh, Gemini's are prone to break their collarbones so and so you know they have to be careful of that so the next sign is cancer and cancer um, has problems with the tummy area so they probably get indigestion um, they worry a lot so they have a nervous a nervous stomach um, and um, it's also they have a tendency uh, with ulcers um, and you know it gives them a reputation sometimes of having a delicate health so the next sign is Virgo and um, Virgo also uh, that rules the uh, intestines and they are a sign that can't eat rubbish. They have to be really careful what they eat and they would probably do better on, you know, when you, you either eat protein or you eat carbs, but you, you don't eat them both together because they're indigest they have suffer with indigestion. Um, so, yeah, Virgos have to be really careful. They um, tend to be uh, nervous as well, um, and they need to have a balanced diet. Um, they, they get anxious, um, but in a different way to Cancerians. So then we've got, um, after that, we've got uh, Virgo, we've got Libra. So Libra rules the kidneys, um, and any disturbance of, of um of uh, you know of their usually sensitive and well balanced you know because libras are well balanced through an accident and argument is soon reflected um through their kidneys so they have to be really careful and then we have scorpio now scorpio rules the sexual organs and um so they they have a tendency to do nothing by halves they're very tenacious and uh, they can be um, quite argumentative. It's a fixed sign, so they can be quite stubborn. So they, you know, it, you have to be careful <laughs> with Scorpio sometimes. Okay, then the next sign is um, Sagittarius. So Sagittarius rules the, the liver, the, the, largest, um, the largest organ and the largest planet and solar system it rules the hips as well and the thighs and um, they shouldn't um, stagnate and they can really put on weight easily they they like sweet things they like to drink a lot they like all the nice things a bit like Taurus actually so does Taurus but Sagittarius you find usually uh, will put weight on because of the liver the liver rules you know um, is, is to do with Sagittarius 
So, right, Capricorn is next, and um, Capricorn um, rules the skeleton, rules the teeth. Um, it um, it um, might have problems with bad backs, um, um, structure of some sort um, might be a problem. Um, the knees um, and, and the t as I say, the teeth, uh, you know, they'll have problems with rheumatism as well. So, yeah, poor old Capricorn, they have to be really careful. So then we have um, Aquarius. So Aquarius, um, again, is uh, rules of circulation. And people with Aquarius strong in their charts suffer from varicose veins and hardening of the arteries. And cold weather in particular is really difficult for them. And then we've got Pisces, and Pisces rules the feet. And when they're affected, even by something minor, like shoes that don't fit, the Pisces will be, you know, will really suffer. And my mum was a Pisces and she could never get a pair of shoes to fit her. She was always complaining. Um, so they have to be also careful about the medicines they take. Um, and because they might be the sign that is allergic to some kind of um, drug that's prescribed to them. So they have to be careful of that as well. So I hope that's helped and um, I'll be back to you soon with some more astrology. So bye for now.